Most of the Midlands saw some light showers on and off throughout most of our Tuesday, and there's still a chance for one more round of some light rain or drizzle later on this evening as the main front makes its way through. But I think after that, the rain should be wrapping up. So by about midnight and through the overnight hours, we'll be completely done with the rain and should start to see some drier conditions return. But it's going to come with those cooler temperatures sticking around. So you still are going to need those jackets, hoodies the next couple of days, especially in the mornings when temperatures start to really dip down as we could be talking freezing cold conditions by the time you wake up Friday morning with lows dropping all the way down into the upper 20s. So definitely going to get very cold here by the end of the work week. Looking at your temperature trend for afternoon highs for the next five days and you can see tomorrow we might briefly get back up to 61 but after that the 50s are going to continue average this time of year is 67. So we're going to continue to be well below where we should be for this time of year. So again cooler temperatures feeling more like fall is going to be the trend here as we go through the rest of the work week and looking at your morning lows you can see by Friday morning dropping all the way down to 28 degrees below freezing again on Saturday and then just 35 for a morning low on Sunday so we are looking at some very chilly morning temperatures heading our way as we get closer towards the weekend big picture shows things beginning to quiet down across South Carolina but we are keeping an eye on some of this activity back towards Augusta and Athens that's with the main front that's going to try and swing through so that's why I do think we have that opportunity for at least a few more light showers as that front finally then pushes out into the Atlantic tomorrow. A new area of high pressure builds down from Canada, keeping us on the cooler side along with a good bit of clouds. Highs near 60 tomorrow. And then that high just continues to be parked over the eastern half, continuing to send down that cooler air. So highs, even though we're going to have some sunshine on Thursday, are only going to be in the lower 50s. And similar story for Fridays. That high just does not want to move a whole lot. So just means the temperatures are going to stay well below average with a good deal of sunshine and drier weather as we wrap up the work week. So for tomorrow, a good deal of clouds, a high of 61, 53 for your Thursday, 54 on Friday with lots of sunshine returning. The weekend's going to look nice and sunny, but it's still going to be cool temperatures in the 50s, and that's how we start off next week with some morning lows getting down into the 20s, even into the early part of next week. Clouds start to build in with temperatures warming back into the low 60s, but it does come with the chance also for a few showers just in time for Thanksgiving.